Canva just released the new text to images app that can actually take the words you type and turn them into images. And in this video, I wanted to test it out and see what it's capable of. With Canva's image generating text to image app, you can simply describe the type of image you want and it will instantly transform your text into amazing visuals with the power of artificial intelligence. And you can generate your AI image by using text to describe the objects, people, colors, location, and anything else you want to include in your image. Within seconds, you'll have several stunning images generated by artificial intelligence that you can print, customize, or use in your Canva projects. Text to Image is a revolutionary tool that can turn your ideas into a range of image types. You can select from several image styles that can be generated, such as drawings, photos, paintings, and even concept art. So let's head over to Canva and check out this new futuristic text to image AI tool. So from the Canva homepage, go ahead and look at the menu on the left and you should see a tab that says discover apps. Let's click that now. This will take you to the discover apps page where you can browse the various apps that are available on Canva. Currently, the text to image app is number one in the most popular section, but let's go over how to find it manually. To get to the text to image app, let's go up to the search bar here and search for text to image. From the search results, the text to image app should be the first option. So let's select it here and open it up. This will open up a dialog box where you can read more information about the text to image app. At the bottom right, you can select to use the app in one of your existing Canva designs or select to use it in a new design. For this example, I think I'm gonna use a new design to test out the app. So let's click on the use in new design button. You'll then see a new menu pop up where you can select the type of project you want to create. You can select from one of the default options, create a custom size project, or go up to the search bar here and search for something specific. It really doesn't matter what I select for this demo, but I think I'll open up a new t-shirt design project. Once your project opens, you should see the text to image app available in the menu on the left hand side. It opens up on a page where you can read more information about the app, but once you're finished, go ahead and click on the Use button. And finally, we're ready to test out the new Canva Text to Image app. And the cool thing about this is all you have to do is describe the type of image you want in the text box here, select the style of image you want, and you'll be given a selection of some really cool AI generated images. To describe the type of image you want to create, you can include things like the objects you want to include, the people, colors, location, surroundings, and anything else you want to include in your image. So for the first example, I think I'll generate an image of a ninja running through a dark forest. Now that I've described my image, I can now go down and select my image style. Currently, we can select from a photo image, a drawing, a 3D image, a painting, pattern, or concept art. And if you really don't know what style you want, you can simply select the surprise me option. So for this first example, I think I'll select to generate a drawing. Once you select your image style, go down to the bottom and click the generate image button. And the AI will then start generating my custom ninja running through a dark forest image. As you can see, the AI actually generates several images that you can select from. Keep in mind these aren't images found anywhere else. These are custom images generated for you by AI. Once your images have been generated, you can select the image you want to use and click it to add it to your project. The images that the AI generates are actually pretty amazing. It's already very good, and over time, it's only going to get even better. Once you've added your image to your Canva project, you can edit and customize it any way that you like. If you don't like any of your images and want to view some others, simply go down and click the Generate More button. The AI will then go to work again and generate some more images for you to view. There we go. I think these images are actually even cooler than the last ones. So far, I think my favorite one is this one on the bottom right here. The ninja looks like he's really on a mission, and I like the shadow and shading of the trees. So we got an idea of how the drawing style images look. So now let's click the start again button and check out another one of the image styles. But before we generate our next image, make sure you click the link in the video description to unlock your free trial of Canva Pro. With Canva Pro, you can access the entire Canva library of images and graphics, thousands of professional design templates, export your designs with transparency, unlock the background remover, and tons of other awesome features to help you create amazing designs. To try Canva Pro for free, 
head over to jasongandy.info and click the Unlock Canva Pro button, or simply go to the link in the video description. In my opinion, Canva Pro is a must-have tool for any online designer or entrepreneur. So let's check out some of the other image styles that AI can generate. This time for my image description, I think I'll search for a cute dog wearing sunglasses. And we selected a drawing for our image style last time, so this time let's try a photo. Once we select our image style, we can then go down and click on the Generate Image button. And within a few seconds, we have some photo style AI generated images. And just like I asked for, it generated some really cute dogs wearing sunglasses. And these are all pretty cute, but it seems like photos might be a little easy for the AI to generate. So let's go back and try a more difficult style. For my description, let's try deep sea diver encountering a sea monster. And for my style, this time, I think I'll generate a 3D image. Now that I've added my description and selected my style, let's click on Generate Image. And here are my 3D images generated by AI. And these are some pretty cool 3D images, but I don't think I see a deep sea diver anywhere. Sometimes you may have to rearrange your description to get the type of images you want. So let's change the description here to read Divers Swimming from a Sea Monster. Once you update your description, you can then go down and click the Generate More button. And within a few seconds, we'll have some new images generated by the AI. And these AI monsters are definitely some weird looking creatures. And the only one I see that has my diver is the one on the bottom left. So let's check this one out a bit more closely. As you can see, the AI technology isn't always perfect, but it's super cool to play around with and see what you can create. So now let's go back and enter one more description because I want to see how the AI generates concept art. For my description, let's try car racing through the city. And under choose your style, let's go to the last option, which is the concept art. So now let's click on generate image and see what it comes up with. And voila, here's my car racing through the city concept art. So far, I think these are my favorite. This is a really cool style and probably something I would actually hang on my wall. But the uses for your images are pretty much unlimited. On Canva, you can use them to create custom designs, add them to print products like t-shirts, or even use them to create some amazing social media posts. For designers and content creators, I think this can come in very handy. So that's a quick overview of the new Canva text-to-image AI tool. If you enjoyed the video, it really helps a lot if you'll hit the like button and subscribe to the channel. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.